Most engines have valves, which control the air coming in and out, much like people breathing in their nose and exhaling through their mouth. The power of an engine can be manipulated through these valves, much like a person can determine how much air they take in by how much they open and close their mouth. Obviously, this is 2023 KX 250 head, right? So everything comes into here, then through the valves, valves open, goes into the combustion chamber, fires, and then it goes out the exhaust port. There's two intake valves, there's two exhaust valves. The intake is the delivery side of combustion and the exhaust is getting rid of it. The changes that it did to the 23 cylinder head for us are gonna be a major improvement. Smaller intake port, smaller intake valves, combustion chamber being smaller because they pushed the valves together again. The combustion chamber being a little bit more open than last year is better. And the valves being smaller and being closer together, now there's more space over here on the side for the valve to, to gain flow off of. So it's, it becomes a more efficient combustion chamber. The trend in the past was maybe a bigger valve, like a lot of AMA flat track bikes, but for Supercross and Motocross, we spend so much time partial throttle and stuff, so the response is really critical. So like if you come out of a corner and you're rolling on the throttle, they always want to get it to pick up quicker, right? So this bike right now has more power than last year's bike and has a smaller inlet valve and port that would have more partial throttle response and more feel on the bottom. It wouldn't have so much of a dead spot. You know, you tell somebody, oh, you know, we should try smaller valves and they would probably immediately say, well, it's gonna have less power. But if you can imagine taking a garden hose and you turn it on wide open, it's probably gonna go like two feet from the end of the hose. But if you restrict it and you put your thumb over it, now it'll spray 20 feet, kind of squeezing it and you're picking up velocity. Any bike that has more bottom power picks up easier and it feels lighter to the throttle and it's a much better engine.